Hey there everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Red. Now, before I started this episode, I did a few things. I am just going to show you first of all where that Pokemon aid I was on about in the last episode. It's not to the west of Fuchsia, it's actually to the east. So if you just go east of Fuchsia, talk to this guy, have 30 Pokemon caught and he will give you an experience all. Now if you go down here, there are lots and lots of trainers. They all have grass uh, poison types such as Oddish to face and they also have flying types. So I've been able to uh, train Snorlax to level 40. He learnt Body Slam. I've also given him Earthquake. Um, and I've also got Jolteon to level 40 as well. Um, just before we continue with our adventure I also want to go back to Lavender for a second because there's a certain item that I've missed and will be essential for our next Pokemon. Oh yeah, I've also... Uh, Jolteon's also learned uh, Thunder Wave at level 40 which uh, guarantees paralysis apart from on ground types who are immune to electric. So anyway, let's... Uh, this is south of Lavender City. Um, there's lots of There were lots of trainers here but I've used them for training already. Uh, don't need that item. Now if you go down here, there is actually another Snorlax down here to face. Um, I'm not going to face it, I'm going to wake it up and then I'm just going to cut the battle out. Because uh, I don't need it, I already have one. Uh, but if you miss your first chance, um, then go nuts and try it. Um, so I'll see you once I've woken this up and we'll be on our way to the item that I need. See you in a second. And welcome back. I was thinking about killing it, but, you know, I, I can't kill it, it's too nice. Anyway, uh, oh, we have a battle. I obviously didn't get all the battles down here, because uh, Snorlax was blocking the way. So, uh, let's kill this guy. Rockers tend to have electric types, such as Voltorb. And I'm leading with an electric type, such as Jolteon. Uh, not a good combination. So your quick attack will do good damage. Uh, oh, ow. That's not very nice. Oh dear. Oh well. At least it's dead. And the rocker cries a sad tear as his beloved Voltorb explodes. Electrode is the evolved form of Voltorb. Oh, I have no earthquake left. Oh well. It learnt Body Slam at level 35, it's a much needed move, it's a normal type move, it can cause paralysis. Uh, as it's a normal type move it will get a boost in power, because Snorlax is also a normal type Pokemon. But we continue, and here we have the Fisherman's House, I hope, yes. He is the Fisherman Guru and he will give you the final rod, which is a super rod, and I will be needing it for our next Pokemon, who you will find out soon. Now all you need to do now, fly back to uh, Fuchsia City. So uh, let's go. Uh, I'm just going to quickly heal up, but I'll be with you in a second. And welcome back. I've healed up. Now uh, we need to go south here. And if we go south, we will meet some water. And some trainers. Can we get... can't get past them. Darn. Oh well. I just want to try out my super rod uh, before we go surfing, uh, just to see what we get. There are four Pokemon you can get around here by fishing with the super rod, those being Goldeen, um, who are the other three? Goldeen, uh, Staryu, uh, there's a couple more I can't quite remember. And I did check it just like 20 minutes ago as well. Oh, Sheldo was definitely one of them. Uh, and one more. And the Pokemon that we want is Staryu. Staryu is a great Pokemon. It's quick and it learns a lot of TMs, a lot of different elemental types. So um, I think this is the water we can fish in, so um, let's venture on in. Oh, we have a battle. Is it against the Staryu? No, it's against a horsey. I don't even think I have uh, poke, uh, Pokeballs, so uh, if I don't, I will quickly cut again and I'll go to buy some. Do I have Pokeballs? Nope. 
I am obviously well prepared. I will get some Pokeballs and we will be back in a second. And welcome back. How about we try that again, shall we? Much more prepared now. So uh, let's have a look for a star you. We've found a horsey so far. And the winner is... Not me, Goldeen. So that's two of the four Pokemon you can get. I've decided to put Farfetch'd at the top of the list, although that's probably not a good idea for escaping. Uh, if you can't escape, just uh, switch to a stronger Pokemon and uh, you'll be able to run away. I want to at least get Staryu in this episode, so if I don't get it on this turn, I'll keep trying and I'll come back when I actually meet it. So, fingers crossed everybody. Come on. Come on, Staryu. Come on. Here we go. Here we go. Staryu. Go. Shelda. Oh. <laughs> That's three of the four. Okay, so I'm just going to cut out this bit and we'll try again. Alright, let's try that again, shall we? Alright, so in theory we've met three of the four Pokemon you can meet here. I think it's a 25% chance of uh, seeing one of the four. I think they all have equal odds. So, come on. I want that star you. Uh, okay, well, I'm definitely going to cut until I find it, so see you in a bit, guys. And welcome back. Look what I just found. Could have had a star f uh, seafood lunch with all the Pokemon that I just faced. But I digress. Ooh, star you. Ouch. Okay, so I've just brought Farfetch'd in just to um, knock him around a bit, so to speak. Although I think he's dead already. Okay, we'll bring in our next Pokemon. We'll bring in. Geo dude. <laughs> Let's hope he doesn't have water gun. Tackle. Okay, that's good. We resist tackle, so that's good. Let's use strength. Strength's a bit stronger, just a bit more inaccurate as well. So that's more like it. I like this, it's working. It's working! <laughs> Woohoo! Now Star you despite being a water type, can learn Thunderbolts. Um it won't be doing, because I gave that TM to Jolteon, but it can do, so if you have your uh, TM handy, give it to Staryu. Uh, it, got, uh, it can also learn Recover, you can also give it Psychic, you can also give it Ice Beam, Surf, the, the, the full... whatever, the full load of TMs. I'm going to leave it in Bill's PC for now, though. Um, I'm going to do that because I don't need it yet. So uh, let's uh, sail to our next island, shall we? We're, this is our first bit of proper surfing, really. And we're going to have quite a lot of Pokemon battles on the way. So as they're all water Pokemon, I've put Jolteon at the lead, but these aren't going to be very strong Pokemon. They're all going to be uh, tentacles, I think. I think I can get to the next island from this route. I'm hoping I can. If I can't, I'll be very sad, but I'm sure I can. Um, I'm going to dodge all these. I'm going to use them to train them later. Um, as I said, I, I do all my uh, grinding offline. Ooh, couldn't dodge him. Okay, well, looks like we're going to end it on a good old battle, shall we? Here, com here comes Jolteon, and he's going to face a very happy swimmer. He's got himself a Shelder, who is a water-type Pokemon evolves into Cloyster, who is quite a good defensive type Pokemon, but that's about it. It does learn Clamp, which is one of those annoying Wrap type moves. Oh, talking of Cloyster. Scary looking thing. Uh, it's dead in one anyway. Uh, these swimmers are good to train on because they're all around level 30 Pokemon. Uh, especially if you have an electric type, or if you have Bulbasaur, who is a grass type, you can really make quite a few levels uh, in the in this route. Da, 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 da. I love the music on this game; it's just so uh, just so happy. Now we will be visiting this planet. Oh, crud. Okay, well we might as well do this bit now. Uh, we're not going to go. Can we do this bin now? 
you know, I don't want to do this bit now, but we will be visiting here later. This is Seafoam Islands. There's a legendary Pokemon we want there. Instead, we're going to go to Pallet Town. And I know you're asking, why would we go to Pallet Town? Well, you're going to have to find out next time on Let's Play Pokemon Red. See you guys.